guys, welcome back. I'm Melissa. So today I'm very excited because I got home and I had a package. I had this package and it's from Uppercase and I'm so excited. So I'm gonna open it for you guys. Um, and if you guys don't know what Uppercase is, Uppercase is a monthly YA subscription and um, you can choose either the book option or the book with like one or two bookish goodies. They more focus on the book and they're um, one of the more inexpensive monthly subscriptions. So if it's something, like if that's something you're looking for, I would suggest uppercase because it's a little bit cheaper than some of the other ones. Because um, like I said, they only really focus on the book. They don't focus on the bookish goodies as much. And I really love uppercase. So far, every single book that I've gotten from uppercase, I've really enjoyed and really, I loved them. Um, but I, I don't know. I just really enjoy uppercase. So I got this box right here. Well, it's really a bag. It's not really a box, but they call it an uppercase box. But, um, so I get the, um, book with the bookish goodies because I don't know. I just flourished on myself and said it. <laughs> but so far I have not, never been disappointed with uppercase. Um, I, I also don't, I, I buy a subscription. I am not paid to promote uppercase. I just really enjoy them. Um, they've been a really good company and I've been happy with every single book that I've gotten. So, so yeah, I'm really excited about opening this. So I'm going to get into this. So I'm going to pull out the little spoiler thing. And it also has a little uh, letter from the author. And one other thing I really like about Uppercase is they try to find books that are more, like, less known. And they pick out some pretty good books. So... The first thing I pull out of here is this really cool bookmark. It's wood. It's a wooden bookmark. This is really neat. I love bookmarks and I just I just think this is neat because it looks like a rocket, but then at the end it looks like a dragon. So, I'm not sure exactly where this is from, but I'm going to open it so you guys can see it a little better. See, it looks like a rocket, but then this end looks like a dragon. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I think that is really neat. Okay. It says, we read to know we're not alone. It's just a little bookmark. And it just has uppercase on the back. I'm going to look at the little spoiler to see where this is from. So, um... Soar into Space bookmark made by Victor Engraven. And this is an uppercase exclusive. That's really neat. Okay. So, let's see what else we got in here. Oh, this is so cute. It's a sticker. It's a cute sticker. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So, I gotta look and see here. Uh, Kawana, Kawani typewriter is also an exclusive uh, uppercase exclusive which that is so cute it's I love stickers although I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it because I don't have a sticker book like I did when I was a kid so let's see what else we got in here no one knows but we will a conspiracy of stars and it's a magnet it's a little it's a little magnet and then, of course, they have the bookmark, and I really like this uh, this feature that uppercase says. Um, so it has the page number and then the code, and when you get to that page as you're reading, you can go to the website, put in the code, and they do like polls, questions, videos, and it's more like an interactive reading, which is really cool because I did it the one time um, with the one book I read from them, and it was really cool to find out more information about different things, and it's really neat. So... So, oh, let's see. I declare, after all, there is no enjoyment like reading. Jane Austen. That is so pretty. I really like that. Jane Austen, quote, art print is another uppercase exclusive. That's really pretty. So, the book for this month is A Conspiracy of Stars by Olivia A. Cole. And I have never heard of this book. And, of course, all the books from Uppercase are signed. So that's also really cool. So shall we read this to figure out what this is about? 
Octavia has only ever had one goal, to follow in the footsteps of her parents and become a prestigious white coat, one of the scientists who study the natural wonders of folia, folia. Um, the secrets of the jungle's exotic plants and animals are protected fiercely in the labs by the central of Natera. So when the rules suddenly change, allowing students inside, Octavia should be overjoyed. But something isn't right. The newly elected leader of the council has some extremist views about the way he believes Natera should be run, and he's influenced others to follow. When Octavia witnesses one of the folia, um, the indigenous people of fo fo I don't know these words. <laughs> Uh, being attacked in front of her in the dark of night, she knows the council is hiding something. They are living in separate worlds on a shared planet, and their fragile peace may soon turn into all-out war. With the help of Ron Rondu, a quiet boy in class with the skills for hacking and a, a quizit and her inquisitive best friend Alma. Octavia is set on a collision course to discover the secrets behind the history she's been taught and the science she's lived by and the truth about her family. Oh, this is a debut uh, debut novel. That's really cool. Sounds interesting. So, so yeah, that's what that one's about. So that's, that's really cool. I'm really excited about this. I have never heard of this book before. So, so yeah. So that's all from the uppercase box this, this month. I am excited about all of this, obviously. And I absolutely love this uh, Jane Austen print. I might see about framing it and maybe put it on my bookshelf because I really think that's neat. Um, I like that. But anyways, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe um, if you like to see more. Um, I appreciate each and every one of you. I thank you from the bottom of my heart for subscribing. I really appreciate pre appreciate you guys all. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and if you like to follow me on other social media platforms, you can. And I'm sorry this video is not the greatest. Um, I just got home from a trip to Dixon. So I'm just kind of like rushing through this because I got to go pick up my kiddos. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys next time. Bye.